What's going on guys? Today I'm going to give you a quick tip on these caster wheels. They're basically anti-scalp wheels. Whenever you get them from the factory, they're going to be in the bottom hole. Uh, I used to run mine there, but um, now I've found if I run them about a quarter inch below the deck, uh, if you're cutting, like my mower, if you're cutting anywhere three inches or below, and they're on this first hole right here and you go to make a left turn or something and there's a slight heel this wheel will catch in the ground and actually you know tear up the ground to where if you have it this way uh, it won't do that but you definitely want it at least a quarter inch below your deck um, and so like if you're cutting three and a half if you're cutting three inches and above only uh, you could probably get away with this bottom hole and this is on a gravely um if you're cutting if you ever cut below two in i mean below three inches like some yards i do on 2.75 where the owners are just real picky and they want it done weekly you know real low and uh and that's why that wheel so torn up after you know i had it right here and i started cutting some of these people weekly on 2.75 which i don't like to do but that's what they want so i personally think that's a little too short but uh anyway um uh, that's why i moved it up so you know when you get it from the dealer it's going to be right here so if you cut anything under three inches you probably want to move it here and uh also remember we can always work that foot pedal so uh, if you see a big stump coming up you know just push your foot pedal up and that's on a zero turn of course not a uh standard and she needs a bath i'm about to give her a bath her a bath um that's about it guys i was just just about to bathe her just mowed my grass um so just giving you guys that quick tip a lot of people don't know that you can move those and a lot of people do know that you can move them but they don't know why so that is why guys if you cut anything under three inches you're gonna want to go here if you're three and up probably be safe here but if you're you know if you're cutting any a lot of yards at three inches you're probably still better here but that is on a gravely I just like to keep it a quarter inch under the deck so it's really just whatever you use i got a 52 inch deck so it doesn't scalp bad anyway but uh just be careful and you've got the center wheels as well so remember to move those you've got these annoying dogs at the neighbor's house i can't even come check my mailbox without them coming out but my yard's finally starting to stripe we've only lived here since january um uh, right there in the front i'm gonna either seed or sod that look at them crazy little dogs anyway but uh so my yard's starting to stripe pretty nice uh been working on it to get the weeds out stuff like that so pretty proud of that starting to stripe pretty nice uh and like in this the reason i bring you over here is that is from a scalp wheel and then i moved it up to the second notch i don't know why i haven't moved it yet i just got it last year and i guess i just wasn't thinking but uh once i moved it up as you can see no more of that so yeah my yard's finally starting to stripe nice uh like i said this dirt spot the previous people used to park all over there and ride foilers and stuff but uh finally starting to stripe up pretty nice here at the crib but uh, just figured I'd give you guys that quick tip. Adjust those wheels. Um, like I said, three inches and up, you can roll on the bottom. If you do anything below three inches or if you cut a lot on three inches, um, you know, you can roll the other way. But appreciate you guys watching. Like, subscribe, comment. Sorry for the non-edited video. I was just making a quick one for you guys. I was trying to get Dosh in here, but I don't see her. But yeah, the yard's starting to look good. The weeds are going away. Uh, so that's it, man. Appreciate it. Y'all will appreciate y'all watching. Thanks.